but I thought uh, whilst I'm in the mood for a bit of soldering I'd put my uh, terminal end on from a battery cable. I want it to go from the, the front to the back to the um, to the starter switch. Uh, so I've had to, uh, I haven't got any small enough if I'm honest. They've got bigger ones, or bigger, where am I? Uh, bigger ones, but they're just too big, so. Um, I just sweat it off, is that the right term? Sweated one off of the, um, the old, oh goodness, off the old batch cable. Um, just about to put it on this one. And this basically is um, going to run from the, the boot of the car, the trunk of the car, right to the front. A bit like minis used to, but basically where I'm going to be putting uh, the brake servo on the car. I've got no room for something's going to have to go. Basically, um, I could get a an internal heater, but it's money again, so it's easier for me to just um, run a cable from the front to the back and put the battery in the back. So that's what we're we're up to. Quite big stuff, so I think it's going to take a little while to warm up. It. It's very slightly thicker cable. There's more. It's um, the diameter of the. Uh, it's about a little bit. The um, diameter of the cable that I'm using is very slightly thicker, and it's just because that's what I've got, basically. So I've. Um, I'm gonna have to trim a couple of uh, little wispy bits off. Anyway, so. That's on there, that again. Okay. okay, so I've got um, my battery cable just loosely pulled into the boot, into the trunk of the car. So I've got a grommet there ready to put in the hole, we've decided how long it's going to be. But um, I'm basically going to start, um, I'm going to use uh, these little P-clips uh, along with these little rivets, they've got a nice big head on them, and I'm going to run along the car starting up the front end, uh, dropping the rivets everywhere, and um, start putting them in. I've uh, connected them already to, me, to my uh, starter pull, and I've Got one P clip connected. That's the uh, the cable from the star motor. So I'm just basically going to run it down the bulkhead. So we'll, uh, we'll get on with that. Well, because I'm um, making holes all over the floor, I'm going to be putting uh, a little bit of Tiger Seal on the rivet and. Uh, and the base of the, um, I'm going to put loads on there, but a little bit mad. A um, little bit on the rivet and a little bit on the uh, base of the P-clip to act as a bit of a gasket. And then, um, otherwise I'll be having, uh, or Mary's, uh, <laughs> Mary's feet will be getting wet. Well, I don't know if you're going to see this very well or not, because I'm underneath the car. Um, but I've got... Got uh, main battery cable running. Ooh. Um, so not through the hole in the boot. 
It's just a matter of uh, getting the battery. Oop, in. Let's get out. Oh, flipping it. Oh, oh, oh. Um, it's just about getting the battery in now. Oh, getting the grommet set back in. That hole there is for um, that hole there is for a um, for the fuel sender unit, and that hole there is an idiot hole. It's the first. I was going to put the battery cable up there, but there's a there's a moulded underneath the underneath the floor there, I should have checked, should have got off my, you know, got got down and checked it first, so, but I didn't, and uh, there's an extra hole, it goes to nowhere, so I'll, I'll put a grommet in there and uh, seal it back up.